What's going on YouTube? My name's Black Sonic. Today, this is my Black Ops 2 Call of Duty Ghosts themed class setup for you guys. And basically, I've got the personalization pack, the Call of Duty Ghosts one, and you get the skin when you pre-order Call of Duty Ghosts. But in the recent update, they've actually updated it to a full personalization personalization pack, sorry. And you get three reticles and you also get a title which you can see you can't see it when I kill anyone because for some reason it's glitching out. But when I get the kill cam, spoiler alert, um, you'll be able to see the title and it really does look good. But you should, if you've pre-ordered Call of Duty Ghosts, it will be in your DLC section of your title. So go and check that out if you've actually like pre-ordered it already and it should be there. But basically, this is all based around being a ghost and things like that. I just wanted to make it themed for Call of Duty Ghosts. And basically, I'm using the SMR, and I've decided to use the SMR because I wanted a gun that you could sort of stick to the outskirts with. You're not... The whole point of being a ghost or stealthy, you're not running in and just spraying people down. You're not mowing them down. Like, you've literally, you've literally got to stay on the outside of the map, and you've got to be stealthy. It does require a little bit of camping, and I wouldn't call it that campy. It is a little bit campy, but it's not too bad. Like, you're not going to make people go absolutely nuts, I suppose. But at the same time, I really didn't want to die there. I was jumping everywhere trying not to die. But basically, yeah, it does get a little bit campy at times when you play a class like this, especially on a tiny map like this. Like, here, I'm surrounded by enemies. Look at my map. There's one there, one there, one there. Or my only choice was to sit in a corner or something like that just to get somewhere. If I ran out, I would probably die. With the SMR, you can't really run out and 1v1 someone, especially if they've got an, like, an assault rifle or anything like that, like any other type of assault rifle, because they will probably take you down. They can take you down a lot quicker unless you have an extremely, extremely fast trigger finger. But even then, I think there's a cap on how fast you can fire the SMR. But basically, let me go through my attachments and everything. My attachments is silencer, stock, and EOTech sight. I've used the EOTech sight because, again, you're sticking to the outside of the map and you're going to be aiming in. You need a good aim in. I didn't really want so far. I didn't want a massive one. Like, I didn't want the ACOG or anything like that because that would be too much. But I just wanted something that you could, like, be on the outside of the battlefield. Like, of the main area, you want to be on the outside of that. Not, like, really far back. But you want to be on the outside of, like, the main area as well where people die basically i've got the silencer for obvious reasons stay off the map and stay silent the stock again so you can just pop in and out of head glitches or out in and out of cover my perks is ghost for obvious reasons cold-blooded and dead silence and these are basically just following the ghost theme basically the only thing i would change out of that is dead silence because it doesn't really come in much handy unless you're playing search and destroy and i'm actually using the perk grid 2 with toughness and that is because i cannot play this game at all without toughness but let me know what you guys think of this class setup try it out for yourself and let me know how it goes but that's the end of the video guys thanks for watching please leave a like please leave a favorite and please share with your friends that's something i've never asked for before so please get on facebook get on twitter share this video with your friends as you can see there you go there's the call of duty ghost title it looks really nice it should be in your download section but thanks for watching please subscribe if you haven't already leave a comment and let me know about this class and if it helped you thanks for watching and i'll see you in my next video